Hi guys, so this week is a video that I really was not expecting to make. I'm supposed to be in the Maldives. Um, quarantine has happened worldwide, which has been a very shocking thing. Change is happening daily. We are receiving stronger and stronger limitations on what we can and cannot do. So whilst I should be on a beach right now, I'm grateful that I'm home safe with my family. I wanted to share with you a day in the life of, of how quarantine has been a normal routine for us now, how we found our flow, how I can work from home with children, be active, keep healthy and have fun. So I just wanted to share with you a day in the life of us. If you have any questions, comments, thoughts or feedback, please leave them in the box below um, and I hope you enjoy seeing what we get up to in 24 hours. Let's go. So something that's really worked well for us as a family is to have a daily routine. When the children were at school, they would have set lesson times, meal times, and play times. So bringing that into the home really has worked well. Our routine includes daily fitness, having breakfast together, lunch, dinner, cooking and cleaning, helping one another out, doing our schoolwork, allowing me to work from home, to exercise both outdoors once a day, at the home gym, and on an indoor bicycle. Um, we have dinner together, we play games, and then allocate some time to computer consoles if the children have been well behaved. And at the very end of the day, we will tidy up and we begin the next day again. So that's our routine split out hourly so we know what we're doing to make sure that we meet all the deadlines for home education and also that I can work and provide for my family as well as the children being safe, happy, healthy. Breakfast time is the first thing on the agenda. I need a cameraman. So I start every day with gluten-free porridge oats. I have them with water. Um, and as you can see, stocks are running low. Oh my goodness. I have around 100 grams of oats with water. And I top this with fresh fruit. Yum. To start with, there was like a mega shortage on food. I don't know if that happened elsewhere, but definitely where we are, all of the food is sold out like immediately. You go into a supermarket, there is nothing to eat. So being gluten intolerant and dairy intolerant, to start with, I was like, this is great. There's vegetables left because everybody bought by pasta, toilet tissues, hand sanitizer, um, tins of soup, like all of the food that is easily preserved. And they left all the fresh and healthy food alone. So I thought, I'm going to be fine. Everybody is bulk buying all of these kind of pastas and, and beans and things. Um, as time has gone on, actually all of the free from ranges have disappeared. So I can't get gluten free oats. It's difficult to get gluten free bread. Um, there is no rice at all. And those are very much staples in my diet as a vegan. I can still buy lots of vegetables, which is great. There are only so many vegetables you can eat in a day and then you physically can't eat any more food. I'm sure now as people have stopped pulp, the peak will begin to reduce and at the end of it, um, shopping should be as normal. But to start with, I was in a very good position and now it's not so good for gluten free. So the children have breakfast muffins, which are, you can put in the freezer, which is great. Normal bread seems to be everywhere right now. It's like the thing that everybody is making and selling. Breakfast muffins, the kids love, and I always do this with a piece of fruit. Smoothies are also a really important way to get vitamins and minerals into children. You can hide so many fruits and vegetables in there that they don't realize they're there. Um, top it up with a little bit of unsweetened fruit juice and serve that at breakfast time, and it's amazing. I always add protein into my smoothies, but for children, I leave it out. Yum!
how are you finding being off the school? Cool, but I don't really <laughs> like the coronavirus. You don't like the coronavirus. That's why you have to be healthy so you don't get sick, don't we? Well, yeah. Yeah, what do we do? Wash hands. And wash face. And wash face, face, face. Yeah. <laughs> So Mies, what happened two days ago? So, our <laughs> dogs locked on or locked together. Yeah. So, they're going to be happy having puppies soon. Minnie's going to be exciting. a puppy! <laughs> which is really Yay. exciting. You're going to be a mummy. you're going to have puppies. And you've been doing lots of research, haven't you? Yes. About gestation and birthing and weaning and yelping. Well, whelping. <laughs> You're a licky licky mummy, you're going to be such a good mummy. Um, so it's really exciting guys that we we wanted our Ajvars to have babies eventually, but it just kind of happened in the quarantine. Um, they said there would be a baby boom for humans and a load of divorces. Hmm. Because people are spending a lot of time together, they don't normally spend together, so people are breaking up or having babies and it seems our mummy had babies! <laughs> We're having babies! We've never had puppies before. Um, so we're going to make a YouTube series on this, yes, because it's something we're really excited about, um, and sharing everything that's involved in having babies, in babies. So keep a watch for that. It's in nine weeks' time. The quarantine is twelve weeks for the UK at the moment, unless it's extended. So um, by the end of this, we're going to have a bigger family than what we started with. Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Yeah. And you put together a PowerPoint presentation. Yes, you'll be able to see that when we next make a video oh, wow. about puppies. Yeah, because we're homeschooling, obviously. Yeah. So that's something that you've set yourself as a goal to research and present all of the information to do with birth and babies for puppies. Now, something you can show your teacher as well. Yeah. You do your lessons online every day. You even do your dance class online now. How are you finding that? Uh, it's quite weird, but it's been fun. <laughs> Yeah, and you think as well, we're not having to leave the house, so we're not driving anywhere, so we're saving money, we're not going out shopping, so we're saving money, the environment is better because there's no pollution in cars on the road, so actually it's a really good thing, isn't it? Yeah. And we're all having a lovely time because we would never normally get so much time together, I'd be at work and you'd be at school, so I think it's, it's, uh, it's fun all round, isn't it? Yay! Right, let's get these protein cookies. <laughs> Come piggies! Oh, wow. <laughs> Chunky. Yum.
movie night. Are you excited? Yes. yes. <laughs> Thanks for joining us guys. We've had a really awesome day and we've tried to keep sane during quarantine. As always, stay safe. And click that subscribe button. Subscribe button, yes. And wash your hands and stay inside. And, <laughs> and probably blow that subscribe button. Blow up the subscribe button. Until next time, take care. Bye. Bye. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel, write me a comment and keep watching for more.